the night before preschool. It was the night before preschool. Alarm clocks were set. All the children were cuddling their favorite plush pet. Monkeys and lions and soft bunnies too would be going to school like big boys and girls do. Parents set out clothes and clean underwear. Hoodies were hung by the front door with care. The children then nestled all warm in their beds, while visions of playtime danced in their heads. But one little boy was still wide awake. He worried about preschool and the friends that he'd make. His tummy hurt, yet he didn't know why. He hid behind mummy. He was feeling quite shy. Hi there, Billy," said Justin. He greeted each child by name. Gather round, and we'll start with a fun clapping game. Kids sang songs and danced dances. They loved circle time. Then everyone listened to stories, and the mother goose rhyme. They dressed up in clothes from the big costume box. Look, I'm a pirate, and I'm Goldilocks. But Billy just watched other kids as they played. In the corner by himself. Was right where he stayed. He drew a dinosaur as tall as a tree. He showed it to Justin. That's great. Is it for me? Then the children picked up their crayons and toys and took a trip to the bathroom. One for girls, one for boys. Let's break for snacks," said Justin. But Billy pushed his aside. Then off the class march for playtime outside. There were tricycles to ride in a big loop de loop, a garden to tend, and sand piles to scoop. After hanging up jackets and wiping off shoes, they gathered their buddies for a quiet time snooze. The kids lay on their mats. Soon there wasn't a peep. All were quiet except. Billy, who could not fall asleep, I can't take a nap without my teddy Jerome, but he's not here. Wailed Billy, I left him at home. When what to his watering eye should appear, but a soft fuzzy rabbit with a bow in its ear? It's okay, a little girl said. Here, take my bunny. And suddenly, Billy's tummy stopped feeling so funny. Thanks," whispered Billy, snuggling up for a nap. And just like that, he was asleep in a snap. After nap time was over, he played with Charlene. "I'll be the blue rings," said Billy, "and I'll be the green." When out in the hallway, there arose such a clatter. Kids sprang to the door to see what was the matter. Parents rushed in, wanting hugs and kisses. Billy's mom brought Jerome and asked, "Did you miss us?" "See you tomorrow," said Justin. "Wow, the first day was done. I'll be back," Billy shouted. "Preschool is fun."